Hey, what's up? How you guys doing? It's me, Mr. Four Cap Scaler. On this video, I want to talk about a little bit about the motion flow and the soap opera effect, and how do you determine what is a really good motion flow soap opera processing effect? Which television has the best processing soap opera motion flow effect? What motion flow basically is it's a fast moving picture that is being duplicated so that way it looks as if it's put all in one frame and the way it's measured it's in measured in the judder the less judder does that motion flow has the better it's going to be now what is the judder well one example like right here for example uh, look at this rifle and you can see a little bit of judder but not to the point where it's ghosting uh, the key thing is to reduce that judder and keep the constant motion flow. That's the key thing. All right. If you can't uh, reduce that judder and that judder is constantly presented, then you don't have a good motion flow. But luckily, Sony X900E has a really good processing chip that avoids that judder. And it totally removes that judder. And that's why I keep telling people that Sony X900E has the best motion flow because it has less judder. Okay, the judder basically it's a ghosting that it's trying to keep up with the with the fast moving image. Okay, so if you can see that judder and that ghosting, I like to use the word ghosting. In the basic terms, I want to explain this to you guys. It's a ghosting. What the judder is, it's a ghosting, almost like a shadow of your image. That it's trying to keep up with you but it's lagging and it's not totally keeping up with you and it's called a judder effect like for example right now like right here she's moving okay and i'm following her really fast and if you can see the judder around her then that's not good as long as she's fluid as long as if it's fluid, if she's moving fluid, if my gun is moving fluid, then that means that there is a smooth, less judder experience. And that's why the motion flow on Sony TVs is the best. Especially if you have 930E or if you have uh, A1E OLED Extreme 1 chip. And this is why majority of people are recommending the uh, A1E OLED, Sony OLED, instead of LG due to the fact that it has the uh, that X1 Extreme processing chip and that X1 Extreme processing chip is just going to make this experience much better okay meaning less judder you see like like I'm following this uh, moving stream of river you should be seeing some judder here but you don't see any judder why because it's being reduced by a processing power that this X1 processing chip has. It's keeping up in pace with a with a moving picture, meaning less judder. Even like right here, when I'm swimming, you should see some judder here, but you don't see it. And that's what's so unique about the uh, X1 processing chip from Sony. Hold on. Ah, no, I have died. So there you have it. I just wanted to do this quick explanation on this video really quick. Uh, so there you have it, guys. Thank you for watching. And I'm going to see you tonight on my stream. All right. I might do one more video about the uh, Samsung KS8000 uh, judder and you will see just how much of judder is presented on Sony uh, on Samsung KS8000 versus Sony X900E. You will see that. You will see that tonight on uh, my video before I do my live stream which will be tonight at 8.30 p.m. So... Um, 
Hopefully this video was helpful. I just want to show you and explain to you in basic terms what the judder is and how do you measure a really good motion flow uh, television picture quality. That's what I'm trying to do here. I'm just trying to explain to you how do you measure it. And the best way to measure it, it's by looking at the TV and if the TV has less judder, almost zero noticeable nut judder, you will still see some judder even on Sony, but it's, it's toned down, it's very smooth. And if you have a smooth, fluid, less judder, uh, experience on the on your TV that means that you have a really good motion flow soap opera effect on your television and Sony is definitely the king when it comes to that all right well there you have it guys thank you for watching and I'm gonna see you tonight thank you so much